Here at William Ruto, alikuwa very much naive and adamant at hii kesi ya gashagwa itaenda till 2028. In fact, hii kitu ya gashagwa imekua certified under certificate of agency. <laughs> That's why you could see MPs, including my area MP of Roraka. Anaeza enda na ache public participation ambaye mimi ni kivyangu nilikuwa naona ni illegal pale bomas. So, Mr. Kiberenge, from where I sit, yes. impeachment in the next three months, it's either Kashagwa Nyumbani or yeah. kwa Meriten City. Yake. In a nutshell. Another one, Ningependa Tena Kuripudiate statement ya Ndugu Yangu eh, Kiberenge. Kiberenge apa Kenya, ini siyasa inachezwa. All, everything that William Samoy Ruto is doing is playing politics. Because one, the running mate wake ambaye alikuwa ni deputy rigadhi gashagwa was a strong man. Na msidanganyane hapa gashagwa is not like soprano lady mwishimi wa kindiki. <laughs> gashagwa is a strong man. That's why they have decided to cut gashagwa into pieces as early as yesterday. Is what they are doing. Na gashagwa pia kiri surface Inaambia William Ruto akiwa pale State House. Akiwacha Gashagua pate loophole ama any lacuna, Gashagua will come for him. Gashagua definitely will come for him. So akiwa pale amalize hii shughuli ambayo ameanza. Najua hii hii mireka inenda uh, uh, inenda Senate. I want to tell you Senate is just a conveyor belt of uh, Mr. William Ruto's agenda. Ile kitu ilifanyika pale eh, chini kwa, 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 kwa House of the Parliament, ndiyo itafanyika Senate. Makiu, they are adjacent. The houses are going hand in hand. So wanajua ni nini endelea. Hii kitu ya gashagwa, usidhani hakuna mtu ajui ni nini endelea. Hata senators wanajua, wataenda pale hizo vipenge eight. Ni kweli hizo vipenge, ni vipenge finyu. Hata ukipelekwa kwa chief. Hizo vitu gashagu ana, 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 anaambiwa ati ya mefanya. Chivu anakuwacha uhuru. Hakuna kitu hapo. But since gashagu is playing a wrong politics to his boss, ni lazima wekewe hizo, abla kimeliwe, vilewe ulikuna sema, that one is pure blackmail and serious decoy. <laughs> I tell you for a fact. So, ame blackmailiwa ati yako na mauteli ndugu yangu. <laughs> My friend, si William Ruto alikuwa na Weston, na Uru Kenyatta was just around. Ali nyanganywa hoteli? Ali nyanganywa? Haku nyanganywa. Saza gashagua, akona hoteli, akona, akona AB assets, zile aliakuwa ya akiwa diyo. Na unajua madiyo wa kitambo, walikuwa napewa di kuku. Nani ajui? Hata chief alikuwa mdosi huko kitambo. Even the elder, village elder. Uko nyumbani, walikuwa napewa kuku, kikosa tu kidogo unamuendea na mbuzi. Vile jelda, sasa dio, of that time, nyakatia moi. So, gazagu wa wealth yake, mimi sionelei ya tituanze kuongelea. Ii amekulua na siyasa mbaya mbaya alipiga. Gazagu wa litumika ile tuki campaign in 2002. Akipiga uru, mia kwa mia. That's why they have come for him to finish gazagu wa kwa ground yake. So in politics, eh, ndugu zangu, usiwai kupiga mandugu zako. Eh, when you are in any political office, one, you must mark your territory. Two, you must have robust friends. Wale hata ukipigwa sahi, wanakufikia kwa dakambili wakikusaidia. Kama, deputy, kama leader of majority, eh, eh, kimani jungwa, awezi saidia ndugu yake. I watch that thing in disbelief. Nikajua kumbe gashagu alikuwa na piga a lone ranger politics. Politics must be one inclusive. Ukipiga politics in isolation, ati unataka kuchukua vitu peke yako huko, unakua, unataka 8 billion William Ruta kupe, na ukuli na ile timi yako, ile ulingia na ayo, ni mekula gashagua. Nobody could defend gashagua in parliament. Including uyo Mr. Ndini Nyoro, anasemekana atijana kukua parliament. Sasa alisaidia nani? Kama kura yake inge zabiwa ni 42 against 280. 
Judini nyoro angekuwa pale ya metjana, angesabiwa ati 42. Si walikuwa 41? Walikuwa 44? Angesabiwa ni 45. Against 280. Babu wa wino angeenda kusaidia gashagua, angesabiwa. Another 46. So any person who is supporting you na ajavika pale na ukashindua, alikuwa na support wale watu. So ambieni nini nyoro is a senior fence sitter ambaye ataki lawama na siyasa kama utaki lawama we simu na siyasa. It's either you are with them or you are not with them. Hii siyasa ya kukaka tikati unajua. The aftermath. Kalonzo uliona vila licheza siyasa ya kukaka tikati. Ikuwa ki mzuri. Siyasa ya katikati ukiwa hapa my friend. My dear brother. Siyasa ya katikati cannot take you anywhere. So I want to tell members of the public. William Ruto ako very much adamant and naive that his deputy anaenda nyumbani. Iyo ndiyo kitu munafaa ku understand. Ju akuna in history, ile siku president amesha wai consolidate watu hiyo number. Ato uru kenyata si ati angetoa William Ruto. But ange mtoa, but kitu ambaye ilifanya uru kenyata angetoa William Ruto. William Ruto alikuwa mchanganya wabunge wote. In fact, uru kenyata kukona wabunge unless you are not in Kenya that, that time. Bona faide MPs, in fact, wakikuyu. Awa kukuwa na Uru Kenyatta that time. So Uru Kenyatta could not even think of removing William Ruto. Na Gashagua nataka leadership, na ana mtu amemzingira. So Gashagua, hii si kanisa ya Pastor Dorcas. Hii ni siyasa. Kanisa wacha kwa pale Karen. Hiyo kanisa umeweka hapo. Ama uko nyeri. Ukikuja hapa siyasa, lazima ujue, siyasa is very dirty, na uneza malizwa na sahi, believe me you, as much as you are crying, atigashagu wa ni mzuri, amesha malizwa. Na anaeza enda na ende kabisa, na tumsao kwa siyasa, siyasa huwa watu anasaulika. Is only Raila Amolo Dinga ndiyo ngumu sana saulike juu, anajuwaga ame master the rags of politics. Ukimfinya hapa, mlabda kikufa. Ukimfinya hapa, utampata next time, akirisurface. It's only Raila Odinga. Ndiyakona hiyo. You cannot take from him. But hawe tuengine, hawe tuengine unawaona wamekuja hapa. Waneza kuwa consumed with politics at any given time. Otherwise, brothers and sisters, Mr. Kiberenge, as much as we are in this bunge, we must always know that mwanainchi wa kawaida, ana say, Iyo lazima ujue. Mwana inji wa kawaida. Awana say, the political class. Ndiyo wakona say, juzi bombers. The organizers wa bombers. Walikuwa MPs. Na walikuwa wanaita sympathizers wawo ni wanaita. Na ukipatikana hapo kama una agenda. Agenda ilikuwa ni kashakuwa ndi yaende. Ukienda pale na, 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 na kierere yako. Ask Morara. Ule ndugu ya Morara kwa hapi. Hey. Ask Morara kitu walifanyiwa. Alienda na kierere. Na ajui ni nani alileta wale watu pale. My friend, so brothers and sisters, I, as, as I leave the stage, Mr. Chairman, let us make sure that we remain focused because to Kingilia issue, Gulia Gashagwa and William in his political war, watch our Malizane Uko to one result. But Mimi Kitu Nawachia William Ruto, Ata Kitoa Rigabi Gashagwa, Sasa Rigabi Gashagwa and Alimweka, Awezi deliver kwa Kenyans. Let him now go back to work. Afanyi wa Kenya kazi. Na waje kurudi pale madhare na maheria zingine atibada nataka kutubomua. Hii mambo ya William Ruto kurudi tena atibada kutubomua atibada 15 meters from 30. We will not allow. Now this time round, atuta kubali William Ruto tubomua tena huko madhare malitunaishi. Our areas in the river banks. We will not allow. So the enablers of William Ruto should be on notice that Kenyans will consume him. Kama sahia jafanya wakazi wa Kenya kazi, Regabi was the stumbling block. Thank you very much, members of the Bunge. Thank you.